Hey everybody, how's it going? Mark here, Backcountry Pipe. On uh, Friday evening, not as cold as it looks, but uh, I figure if I dress for the occasion, it will uh, be a little more pleasant. <clears throat> Enjoying a CAO Flathead 550 this evening. First cigar in uh, quite a little while because we've had a bit of cold weather here and it's been busy with uh, hunting season and, and everything else. Um, unfortunately, in Canada, we have these ugly greenish brown labels. A very good cigar. I've had many of these over the year, over the years, I should say. A um, little bit of pepper, just a beautiful Maduro. Um, and I find these cigars um, are like night and day. Um, if you can let them sit in your humidor for about seven to eight months. To me, it just completely changes the cigar. Um, the flavors, uh, everything seems to merge together and you get a nice, uh, just a nice uh, background of, uh, of a light black pepper. Um, coffee. And a touch of chocolate maybe. Not to the extent of a Padron by no means, a Padron Maduro, but uh, pretty pretty good cigar, pretty staple cigar, and uh, one that's uh, widely available around here, <clears throat> which is uh, not overly common these days. Um, the cigar selection uh, around Nova Scotia is pretty pretty slim compared to uh, what it used to be. All the brick and mortars are, are slowly closing up due to, to regulations and everything. But uh, I figured I'd come out. Uh, I got the, the Christmas lights are are up and uh, it's not uh, not cold I think it was up to 11 today but it's gonna cool down I think some rain on the way tomorrow or tonight <clears throat> so I thought I'd come out and enjoy a cigar and uh, and these cigars in particular in the fall are uh, yeah it, it's great box pressed creamy smoke and uh, pretty consistent um, yeah so yeah just uh, enjoying this uh, this tasty cigar <clears throat> um, deer season is uh, pretty much wrapped up for me um, vacation last week I was lucky enough to get a, a four-pointer probably went about 120 pounds um, and my uh, my hunting buddy uh, older fella he got a eight pointer, went about 150. And uh, we both got them on the same day, first time ever. Um, he got his at 8.30 in the morning. I got mine at 3.30 in the afternoon. Um, lots of smaller deer around this year and all the all the big guys were, uh, all the big guys were roaming at night and uh, it just didn't didn't pair up, match up. So coming towards the end of the season, I, uh, I took uh, one of the best ones uh, for eating and uh, still seen, uh, Still see some deer after that that were uh, were smaller with my muzzleloader. Um, had the kids out for probably half the season, which was interesting and fun, and uh, just uh, just an all around good good deer season. But it went so quickly. Um, probably one of the quickest deer seasons that I've ever uh, experienced. Anyway, with that. Just out here uh, enjoying this uh, CAO Flathead 550 camshaft. No wind tonight. Um, nights like this are probably going to be few and far between to be able to, to sit outside and uh, and have a cigar. I go down in the, the man cave down in the basement. I certainly uh, I can enjoy a pipe down there, but uh, sometimes it pushes the limits with the cigars, even though I can uh, vent it outside. Um, but much more pleasurable to uh, to enjoy this. So... Hope everyone's doing well. Um, December first today. We're on the we're in the the holiday season. Christmas is uh, fast approaching, and it's uh, as the kids grow older, it's still pretty fun to to watch the the magic that that comes with it. The advent calendars today. The elf arrived, and uh, as much as some of that stuff's a, a pain in the neck, it's uh, it's it's pretty fun to watch. So, long ashes, and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Cheers.